Bobby has a problem. He wants to find out if he can grow something in soil that he makes himself. He crushes some rock. Crushed rock is the main part of all soil. But plain crushed rock is not enough. He adds the bodies of dead insects, crickets, flies, and grasshoppers. Oh, Bobby, let's climb the mountain behind your house and see how soil is really formed. Rice Canyon, Utah shows the result of wearing away by rain for millions of years. When the sun melts the ice, the broken rocks tumble down. Hitting one another, they break into smaller and smaller pieces. Let's go farther up the mountain. And at the very top, no soil or plants can be seen. Look back at your farm in the valley. Look closer. We can see how this happens right in your own kitchen, Bobby. If we go back to your kitchen, Bobby, we can very easily see what freezing water can do. Your modeling clay will take the place of soft rock. The kitchen spray will be the rain. Deeper and deeper grow the valleys, higher and higher the towers. All living creatures, the worms and ants and even tiny animals which we cannot see, build their bodies with food that originally comes from the soil. And when their life is over, their bodies are again returned to form rich soil.